Hey, what's up, guys? Today I'm going to show you how to change what they call a crankcase breather hose. And what this is, is connect to your master flow. If you get an engine uh, um, engine light come on and the, and the cold read P0101 master flow, they either talk about this here or they talking about this need to be changed, the whole device. And what it is, it takes two Phillips screwdriver just to take this off. You know, you can unloosen it by just pressing this in and pulling it up and taking this out and changing it or either cleaning it out, which will be shown on other videos on YouTube to, on how to do that. But anyways, that wasn't my issue because I changed this here probably a good two or three months ago and it, the engine light still was on. And so what it is, I found out it was this buddy here that I needed to be changed so in order to change this seal you need to take this cover off besides i have a nissan 2011 in order to take this off it's three aloe wrench screws that need to be taken off which i already unloosened it so i'm just gonna take it out real quick to let you see what need to be changed and um i'll also show you the tools that i use to change this which this here, these three here, I used aloe wrench. Which one of them is still a little bit tight. So, so you gotta take these out. So after you take that out, them screws out, you just remove your top. And this is the one that I need to replace, which I already replaced it with um, the old one with this one, which I ordered offline because you can't hardly find it in the stores nowhere. And come to find out that this ain't ain't a perfect fit because once you turn the car on, it don't suction the air good enough. It just squeezes in, which I'll show you before I take it off what I mean. Hold on. All right, you see how it's squeezing in? That's what I mean, it ain't getting no air. So you're gonna be hearing the wine noise and your engine light might still mess up or you can also probably mess things up. So don't order online. Best go to um to the factory place, the Nissan factory place and get the um the one that goes with it, the original. So yeah, so um now I just have to replace this cell with the original manufacturer one. So again, you can't find that. Well, I couldn't find it in my city where I'm from in St. Pete, but I had to go to the Nissan dealership itself and it only cost four dollars so you know that's real cheap and i got it the very next day the very next morning so i'm just going to replace this hill and uh with the new one the manufacturer one and see if this don't squeeze like i just showed you in the beginning so be back with you so yeah again so you just got to put one in this one and the other piece in in that one and you make sure you have the clamp or something to go around it so it can like keep it in place when you put it in. So that's one. Sure. Yeah. Sure. Yeah, I'm here. Hold on, Angie. And that's the other one. Just put it in there like that. Make sure you put it in there good enough so it, it'll fit all the way in like that. And then you want to make sure you have your, your things in the right so when you tighten it you know what i mean it'll be on there right so but yeah that's it so um let me screw it up i'll be right back with you yeah so now that i got this back on right it looked like it's pretty secure so and you can't really squeeze it like the other one was squeezing because you see the difference this one it's a little smaller than the one i brought off amazon you see how big that is or beast that is and all the air just would when circulating it was just squeezing like squeezing so and my and my car was kind of like making a whining noise so let's see how how it be now when i crank it up all right now that i got this on right and it's running it feel like you know no like smush smushed in air it's like it's flowing right now so there you have it again i don't order this offline because they're gonna give you the wrong one man go to the nissan place itself i paid four dollars for that you know what i mean and and it fits so save you some money man 
Again, this is Misery and Pain production or whatever you want to call it. And I'm out.